over fifteen thousand dollars in cash and prizes, and I assume some support out in the audience. I do, I do. Who's out there? Thanks. I have my daughter Kathleen, my favorite son Jimmy, my daughter Mary, and my nephew Nikki. All right, uh, mom and auntie are doing pretty well down here. Uh, spin that wheel. One more call. F. That's one. C. Okay. M. And a vowel. Um, A. All right, let's see how this works out. So far, so good. She might be able to do this. It's tough. I'll grant you that. It's a thing. You have 10 seconds. Good luck. Amazing. Uh, of yard. Amazing piece of work. Amazing something of work. You were right there, man. I'll tell you, that was a really good attempt on a really tough puzzle. Wow. Another five seconds. You would have yeah. been there. I'm sorry you didn't get it. Damn. We have to look in here and see that forerunner. Did you really have a really good night? That was a really terrific attempt. $15,170. Nice going, Sarah. Stay right here with me. And Pat and I will be back in just a second. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So this guy goes into prison. Mm -hmm. First time in prison, mm -hmm. and he's very nervous, you know, and he's trying to sleep the first night, and in the middle of the night, some one of the other prisoners yells out, and he goes, 16, and everyone in the prison cell laughs. He mm -hmm. tries to go to sleep again, somebody yells, four, and everybody, well, the next morning, he didn't have any sleep, that went on all night, he said to the guy in his cell, he said, people keep calling numbers, and he said, we've been in here a long time, we know all the jokes, we just assign them numbers. Oh. So people call out a number, and that's the joke. He said, can I try it? I said, sure. And he goes, 12, nothing. And the other guy said, well, some people can tell a joke, some people can't. <laughs> That's all we got. Uh, we'll see you next time. So long. Bye.